So here we are, uh, Crown Capital Properties, for those of you who are going to join us, have started a couple, I guess it was about a year and a half ago now, uh, with Sherry, Lori, and Joan, uh, Crown Capital Properties. Just a quick, uh, you can see there, it's, a, it's the only developable lot in this entire neighborhood, uh, which is really great. And, and you can't really tell from the overhead shot, but most of the surrounding housing is uh, townhouses or three-level uh, multifamily and single-family. So behind the property is all townhouses. To the left on this side is a multifamily. Across the street is townhouses. And to the right and across the street are single-family homes. So currently, um, this property is zoned commercial. And we are going through the rezoning process right now. It started uh, two weeks ago. So we expect to be going through that in the next six months. Um, it, it, it's zone commercial because of uh, historically a long time ago, the, the lot right beside it was actually a neighborhood pub. That little brown roofed building with the big parking lot um, was actually a neighborhood pub. And they zoned that one commercial to, to try and create a little bit of a neighborhood center uh, because this was kind of the outlying area of Campbell River back when I was young. Now it's grown so quickly and so much that there's actually a, a town center a few blocks away from here that services the whole area. So this little commercial parcel isn't really applicable anymore in the kind of design of the neighborhood. So um, we're uh, very feeling very positive about this getting rezoned to a, a low density multifamily. And we hope to do um, 12 to 14 townhouses on this um uh, piece of property. It's got a fairly significant slope, which we're hoping to make work to our advantage. Um, we have a unique idea. The city, in talking to the city, this is, you can't see it on this map, but we're about two blocks away from the North Island College, and they have a lot of international students that come there for specific training in aquaculture and forestry. And uh, uh, aquaculture is, is quite large in Campbell River. It's one of the leading industries and technology as well. So the, the college is quite robust as far as international students coming in and the city had asked us to consider doing something that incorporated some type of a housing for students. So we're hoping to do something unique uh, with our townhouses and, and incorporate something that um, takes into consideration either students, grannies, nannies or caretakers uh, so that we kind of hit all of the bases and the play on this one right now, I mean, we're still in the very, very, very early stages, but the play on this one would be um, a, a sale. It wouldn't be a rental property. This one would be a commercial sale property. So we'd be looking to market and sell these townhouses at some point in the future. So um, yes, we're excited about what spring will hold. And it's been uh, so far really interesting to go through the rezoning process with Campbell River. They're, um, they're much different dealing with a small town than as opposed to a big city. Uh, in a lot of ways, it's faster and more personal. Um, in other ways, it's a little bit more old school. So it, it'll be interesting for us to learn this process. And like I said, hopefully the first of many.